So uh, our next performer up to the stage is uh, he's another uh, cast member here, Comedy Loser, and uh, he's very, very funny. You might know him for his videos. Uh, he's here tonight live in person uh, for you. Put your hands together and welcome Mr. John David Burton. now a comedy loser for approximately two years and in those two years I've never bombed a comedy loser now I say this not to brag I say this because I know my time is up I know it's coming every, every comedian knows that sooner or later you're gonna bomb it happens it's part of the business and I've been getting so paranoid because I'm thinking it's gonna happen it's gotta happen in every show I'm like is this gonna be the one is this gonna be the one so I just decided if you could indulge me I'm going to face my fear, and tonight, for the first time, I am going to bomb at Comedy Loser. Okay? So I'm sorry if you came for some laughs. I apologize if you're new to the show. Um, bear with me. Please indulge me. Um, I, what I've done is I've gone through my book of ideas, because every comedian has a book of ideas, and, you know, sometimes you look at these ideas in retrospect, and you go, what the fuck was I thinking? What, what is this? You know, so I picked out a few that I thought, there's just no comedic potential to these whatsoever, and decided to perform them for you tonight. Get it over with. What the hell? Let's do this, okay? So, so the first thing that I have for you, uh, it, it, all it said in my notebook was, uh, Smokey the Pyromaniac Bear. Uh, little uh, prop thing here. It takes a second. It's okay. It's all right. It's all part of the... See, it's okay to, to, to delay with props when you're bombing. Because the audience is like, oh man, get on with it, right? <laughs> and, you're, and you're like totally slowing it down, and you're just like, oh, damn it, I should have been more, I should have had this set up better. Right? <laughs> okay, see? Okay, so, what do you want from me? All right? Yeah, I started it. It was me, okay? So, don't get all judgmental. I've been putting these things out for 60 years. 60 years, and you're gonna judge me? Huh? So what if I got a little bit curious? <laughs> All right? Yeah. It's part of the natural regrowth anyway. Do you know that's like recycling? It was a controlled burn. That's right. I burned it, and I was in control. <laughs> so don't judge me! I'm smoky, man! And see. All right, so this is the next scene. Really not well thought out, terrible idea. That was horrible. That was horrible. But, I just want to like you. But if you think, and I know, exactly, it should not have been performed, but it feels good to get it out, to bomb for the first time. Now, it gets worse. Because, because the next idea that I had, um, yeah. All it was was two words, and again, this is one of those ones where I looked at it and just went, what was I thinking? That, like, I, don't, I have no idea what thought process was going through my mind when I wrote down the two words, Hitler Bunny. Careful. Careful. That Hitler replaces the Easter Bunny, if I remember correctly. Uh, let's try this, okay, shall we? Careful. What is this step for? There should only be the white eggs. No, colored eggs. All the colored eggs should be found, and they shall be destroyed. There should be no more black eggs. No more pink eggs. No yellow or red eggs. Just, just a pure white eggs. Like this one here. And, and no more, no more chocolate. There should be no more chocolate, but this is the white chocolate is okay. Yeah. But interestingly, white chocolate is not actually chocolate. It's, it is made from the cocoa bean, but it does not have chocolate liquor in it. It does not qualify as chocolate. It's beyond the point. But I thought I would mention it. It's an interesting little fact. <laughs> Okay, so um, I had one other idea that 
what I thought, again, it's just like, this is just stupid. And, you know, I don't know if some of you know there's a burlesque show tomorrow, it's at the Park Theater, you should check it out. And I only mention that because it's, burlesque is cool, and I think the only person that likes to take their clothes off on stage more than the burlesque people is me. That is you. <laughs> so, <laughs> just gotta get prepped here. See, again, the delay, you know, it's just a bad idea. You don't want to be doing this on stage because it just leads to bombing, you know? There we go. Okay. All right, almost ready. Now, this idea was a full sentence. It's actually an impression. And uh, it was written down in my notebook as uh, impression of the cricket that came face to face with my cat. <laughs> no. Oh wait, there's gloves. Ah, where's the gloves? There they are. There we go. Okay. Here we go. Impression of the cat of the cricket that came face to face with the cat. <laughs>